First tonight, new cell phone video captures the moments after an inmate managed to escape from a prison transport bus near Centerville last week. Yeah, it is now day six in the manhunt for Gonzalo Lopez, a convicted murderer. Our Matt Doherty caught up with search crews in Centerville tonight to find out if there's a chance Lopez is even still in the area. Matt? Authorities say they believe Gonzalo Lopez is still somewhere nearby. A source tells us that earlier today, officers found evidence they believe he left behind shortly after the bus crashed. We saw the inmate. Oh my God. That small white speck trailing off into a field of green is believed to be him. 46 year old prison inmate Gonzalo Lopez running away in his white TDCJ jumpsuit minutes after the prison bus crashed. He's in the woods. In the video, the driver shouts to an officer from a nearby police department responding to the crash, telling him what they'd just seen. He ran towards the house. You think? Yeah, somewhere near that house. So I was in that house might want to be careful. But almost six days later, the convicted killer for the cartel still hasn't been caught. If we didn't think he was out here, we wouldn't be out here looking for him. Texas Department of Criminal Justice spokesman Robert Hurst says the perimeter of the search has been narrowed a small amount. It's now about five square miles. Hundreds of law enforcement officers are continuing the round the clock search effort. As Hearst says, they will stay here for as long as it takes to find him. There's nothing that's telling our investigators, the people that are searching this area, that he's not back there. So as long as they have got credible evidence, information, continuing to look for him, they're going to stay on the tracks and keep looking for him here in Leon County. From Centerville, I'm Matt Doherty. KHOU 11 News.